at Tori's Bapples and Yaya's house. It's an absolute palace. Four story of glorious, gorgeous views. It's just divine. I feel like I'm on selling on sunset. <laughs> a long travel. We've literally traveled what, 19 hours. We're finally here. Oh, wow. You want to see the pizza? What's that one? Pizza. Pizza. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hey, 1.5. <laughs> um, this is the real deal of Greek salad. Oh my love. Yamo. Got the shot, money shot. <gasps> oh, sexual. How much is that? 3 euros. That's like the biggest plate ever. 8 euros. We are off to Mykonos today, getting a ferry, so we're up nice and early. Had about, well, but we've had eight hours, solid sleep. See you soon, Mykonos. Yay! So we're off to George Hotel, and we stayed here last time. We stayed at um, a Crocialis last time, which is... Yeah, Crocialis. The sister hotel, we stayed, yes. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Here's our room. Bed. Stun. So comfortable. There's a full length mirror, which I think is awesome. We are still rocking from the ferry. Here's our beautiful view. Oh. Open this bad boy. Wow. Lush. Amazing. Good lighting. Very happy. It's this bathroom, overhead shower, beautiful big mirror again. Just get ourselves kind of situated in here and then get ready and go out. Not in. <laughs> We're off to the town centre to go exchange money and have a little explore around. This is the outfit. Yay, we found you! <laughs> Sophie and Lily look alike. This is Sophie. Ooh, this is Lily. <laughs> what is she doing? <laughs> Yay. We're back at our hotel now. I am exhausted. We've been tanning all day by the beach. Obviously, we went to the town center, which was so much fun to walk around and just kind of um, explore Mykonos. 6.30 p.m. at the moment and it's like it's still so sunny. The sun doesn't really set until 9 p.m. so we'll probably just get dinner. Jake and I will get dinner by ourselves tonight. But yeah, I'll show you my outfit. Cheers!
Mm. Look at that view. Oh my God. They got a deluxe room. And I ended up getting quad, so we're gonna go quad biking to different beaches, maybe go to Ornos and meet up with the other girls who are staying at Ornos. So it was 70 euros. What was? Our um, quad for the day. This is my outfit. little chill day by the pool. Beach party ready. Outfit. Little vintage number that I've had for ages. Matching. staying in Hanya in this cute hotel Airbnb sort of thing um, called Kamara Residence. This is what I was smelling through the corridor. How was your food? How much was it? $23.50. Shot tastes like pure vodka. <laughs> and then we go shopping. What do you want to do? I don't know, whatever. Didn't bring any towels, so we're literally just standing here. 
6.30 p.m. and it's still so sunny and so hot. I love pistachio. Garispera. We are walking back to our hotel. Um, it's a lovely night, sun set is happening. We are off to Lutraki Beach today. We're getting the bus because there's no cars to hire out at the moment. And then hopefully we'll go into town tonight and try and hire a car. So it's been a freaking mission getting here because the bus never came. So we had to get a taxi, we got the taxi, and then because, you know, not everyone speaks good English, <laughs> the taxi took us to the wrong beach, which was like almost two kilometers away. <laughs> Luckily for Google Maps, seeing this view now has made me feel like a little bit more peppy in the steppy. We made it, uh, just ordered some waters, about to get our menu. Chicken schnitzel and chips with the French sauce. And this looks amazing. Look at this wasp. It's actually right. Tastes good. Tastes sweet. What's it called again? Mastica. Mastica. And this one, what's this called? Cheesecake. Cheesecake. <laughs> we got a car. 60 euros for the day. Um, we're driving to Ella Felici Beach today. Jake's driving. It's all left hand drive, which I find super weird. I'm sitting in the right and it's usually where we drive. We're just getting petrol at the moment. Super excited. It's about an hour and a half drive from the city. Very busy, very windy, but it's really beautiful. The ocean is just like turquoise. Stunning. This is just one side, and then we're standing on this bit of sand, and then there's that other side, and then there's all beach umbrellas all here. I'm glad we got here early though, because it's very, very busy. There was like, hun there's like hundreds of people here. Bunch of pink sand, because people steal the sand. So we're on our way to another beach. So we're now gonna make use of this rental car and go to another beach. We're going to, what's the beach called? Felisana. The sea bass, I think this was like 18 euros. A lot more here there's like boats here and jet skis and um, lots of like different water sports and we just parked at the restaurant that we ate at and that restaurant was really nice it was a little bit more pricier than in town found this on TripAdvisor had a really good review so we're giving it a go I'm drinking a local Prosecco sparkling wine sparkling wine sorry cheers Jake's drinking <laughs> Beer. <laughs> How 
pretty is this? Which is good. It's very good. Yeah, all dolled up off to a wine tour and olive oil tour in the country. This is what I'm wearing. Princess Polly and my bags thrifted. It is freaking hot. We are standing here waiting for bus again. <laughs> Still beautiful. So if you did like this, then that's what you want to like ask for. Oh, you know, I like a light body wine that's you know kind of citrusy. Very excited. Dry, dry, light body, nice citrusy. We need to have our answer how rosé is made. Oh god. In contact with the skins for the entire fermentation process, or you know, 10 days, you're going to end up with a red wine. If you leave the juice in contact with the skins for an hour or two, you end up with a rosé wine. to get rid of the weeds, and they're just a brick thing. The oldest olive tree in the world. So pretty much the review on this is that olive oil extra virgin is the one that you get and it is the best for you, best for your skin, your digestion, your heart health. Thank you for everything. Thank you. Thank you. A random cat just sat on me. What else did Anna Maria say? She said, yeah, Crete, you come to eat. <laughs> That's what I remember. And it's true, all we've done here is eat. It's our last, last hurrah in the town, buying the goods. <laughs> Goodbye, Crete. What was your favorite part of Crete? The food. The food. Oh. Gallimera. We have arrived in Lindos Roads. It's uh, amazing. We got a rental car straight away because we were like, we're not getting buses this time. We are just going to get a car. There's so much traveling involved on this island. Palm Bay Beach. I just had a lovely little dip. Or we, I should say. <laughs> um, first day, pretty much, in Lindos. There are so many beaches here. We're just going to beach hop. This is St. Paul's Bay. This is our local beach to our hotel. Here is the other cove. This is so beautiful. Look at that beautiful balloon. I'll quickly show you our room. Sorry, I am literally sweating. This is the bedroom. We brought the beds together. This is a traditional Greek room. It has the cobblestone and it's really cooling. So it feels amazing. This is our other room that's next door to our bedroom. Little kitchenette. And then the bathroom. We have the shower heads not attached, so pretty simple. Can you see that so wet? Show you outside. The sitting area. Up the stairs. Yes. Yum. what I'm wearing. Pearls. Look at that guys. And we have been not feeling 100% so we've been taking it really slowly the last few days. Um, sleeping in and just relaxing. Not feeling guilty about it because we're on vacation and we're allowed to take a day off and lie in bed all day.
to that person that told us to come here. It's freaking phenomenal. <laughs> so cute. Love, 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 love. Crazy. No, oh, it's fine, don't worry. The roasted vegetables. It smells amazing. And the zucchini balls with, is that cheese? What's underneath it? Probably like, yeah. Like a yogurt, a yogurt thing. Maybe. And that. Beans. Beans. <laughs> Stuffed capsicum. Stuffed capsicum. Moussaka. Moussaka. Meatballs. Beef. Beef stuffato. Beef stuffato. Oh, and I got the lamb chops. Baklava. And apple pie. Apropos. We're going to go check out the Acropolis of. Roads. First century. Third century. Third century, sorry. Third century. Wow, look at those stairs, guys. That's amazing. Wow. Sweaty. Jake's like freaking out. He's like hiding. He's like, yep, I'm out of here. See ya. He's like, fuck about. Any any last words? No. We had dinner last night somewhere. Over there, mm. Stephanie's. Next to Stephanie's. Stephanie, so it's just down there. I don't know where we're staying. We're staying. Oh, I know where we're staying. We're right. Am I pointing at it in that little section? <gasps> okay, guys, I'm fucking freaking out, but I'm just gonna quickly show you. <gasps> okay, that's straight down. Oh my god. Oh my god, nope. I'm not going any further. That's all. That's all. <laughs> Is, is it beautiful? <laughs> it's good that you're not afraid. Yeah, that's as far as I'll go. Oh, yeah, you let, yeah, they're gonna let the kid go down. That's St. Paul's Bay over there. So this place was owned by a female goddess deity named Lindin, Lindin, Lindian, and she was like known for her as like one of the gods, one of those, one of the um, would you say like a goddess or a demi, a goddess? It's like excuse me. Oh no, that guy's getting told off. That was sitting on the edge. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> need to feel alive. We are going to St. Paul's Bay for a swim, which is our local beach from our apartment. It's super cute. I love it here. 
whatever we walk past here I'm always like oh my god it's absolutely stunning it's teasing me I just want to be there now Let me eat. <laughs>